In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create and save tab groups in Chrome. Tab groups are awesome because if you look at here, I have my day-to-day. -day. It's housed up here and here. So if I click on it, this is my day-to-day. -day. Here's my, my Gmail, my calendar, my drive priority, and then Infinite Campus. I could close this one and I could go to my um, tab group for cross-country. So here's my um, cross-country tab. I click on it. Here's my day-to-day uh, -day schedule. Log in to 8 to 18. Here's my roster. Here's my drive folder. And then here's my weekly communications to parents. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to a tab. And it's kind of clunky, but what you have to do is you have to type Chrome colon backslash backslash flags. Once you do that, you actually have to search for uh, tab groups. You have to enable it. By default, it's default, but you have to en enable it. If you don't enable it, you're not going to be able to save um, tab groups. And then every time you close down Chrome, they're gone. So make sure you enable it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over creating a uh, tab group for my art one class so what i'm going to do is um, open up a a tab that i want to see every time so i just two finger tap on the keyboard and i'm going to say add tab group right now you can see i have an art 3 ap which is uh right here i have a cross country and day to day but I want to add a new group and I'm going to call it art one I'm just going to color code it green and then what you have to do is um, toggle right here to to the save group if I don't do this every time I, I quit Chrome it'll be gone this won't be here unless you go through that first clunky step of Chrome colon double backslash flags and then you have to enable it so I'm just going to toggle here and since I color coded it green um, art let's spell art correctly here art one and I'm just enter it I could take another tab and just drag it right in there and then you see the outline of the the green and it goes all the way I could take this drag it in drag it in so now my art one can open and close and then it just saves so much space on your uh, tabs up here but you know what I want to move them around the first thing I want to do is look at my day-to-day -day, and then I'm probably going to go to Google Classroom um, and then here's my sketchbook and then here's my art one I really oh I want to show you if I quit Chrome and now I open up Chrome again to log in here they're not up here but it's not the end of the world just go to day to day and then it shows up and you could you could close your other tabs if you want that, that's just what I had open in another window actually um, so here's cross country it comes up there here's art 3 AP and then art 1 and then you could open them close them so this just saves a lot of real estate up here with all the tabs that you use day to day don't hesitate to, to flag me down, and I will go over this one-on-one -on -one with you if uh, this tutorial doesn't help.